hi guys welcome to my channel Bucky Starch, where we share all our DIYs and I am Bucky today I'm making butter as you can see I'm using a cake mixer and my heavy cream is right here so we're gonna start by pouring the heavy cream in the mixing bowl I have attached my wire whisk you know the mixer comes with different attachments so i'm using the wire whisk so we're gonna start by choosing the lowest speed and gradually increasing you know i don't have a splatter guard so i have to be very careful how i'm mixing if you don't have a splatter guard you can even use like half towels on standby just to do some covering This is becoming thicker and thicker. This is no whipped cream. Yeah, but we have to now continue just whipping it until it, the milk separates from the butter. See, the separation has already started. There's a bit of milk there. Yeah. Let's pause and do some scraping. Yeah, this is my the first time I'm pausing. Yeah, so let's just scrape all the sides so that everything just mixes evenly. Yeah, all that buttermilk needs to be extracted from the butter. Mm -hmm. Yeah, look at that. You see the, the buttermilk is dripping from the wire whisk. Yeah, let's get back to our mixing so that all that buttermilk is extracted from the butter. Yeah. Yeah, let's pause that now strain out all that milk if you want you can detach the wire whisk but i just choose to pull out the ball and then put a plate below just to catch the dripping <laughs> yeah the drops of milk there and then we pour and strain just in case there's a bit of butter that will just fall into the milk so it will be trapped on the strainer yeah this is how i do it i don't know how you do it people do things differently so back to mixing again so that every bit of milk comes out from there Yeah, let's pause again so we can strain out the milk. So after we strain out the milk, then you have your ice water and you keep um, pouring the ice water and kneading the butter with a spoon or a spatula to extract all the milk from it. You stop until when the water starts looking clear then after that you press the butter press the butter to extract all the water from the butter yeah and then add salt or if you want it salted or unsalted it's all up to you but you just press press and remove all the excess water from the butter yeah so this is our lovely butter and this is our buttermilk. This is 
is our homemade butter and it tastes lovely thanks for watching guys please subscribe like and share bye